Next, we would like to introduce Chastity Brown. Hello. Good evening. I've always wanted to open a show by saying, I'm a tree hugger. I grew up, maybe y'all already know this, in a small town in West Tennessee uh, with a super Walmart and about four stoplights, not a lot going on. Um, and maybe some of you might think I'm young, but in the sense of the, it still being the time where you get, can get lost in nature in, in, your, in the backwoods of your small town. And that's what I would do. And um, I, think, I think it seemed a little weird, um, but I had a good time doing it. And, I, and I've always thought that there's something so humbling and so magical about nature. Um, there's a spot in northern Minnesota um, and over in Wisconsin that I go to with family and friends. And as soon as you step out of the car, um, especially as a musician, quite often your ears are fatigued and maybe even those of us who are constantly busy, you don't realize how much we're constantly just hearing and how even silence um, can be affected by climate change. Uh, and I just, I love that euphoric experience of being in the woods and being bathed in silence. And as a musician, I, very rightly so, because of a lot of you here, I like now get to tour the world because of the local support of Minnesotans since I've been here. One of the places that I've toured to is a small village called Manai Bridge, which is in the northwestern point of Wales, just to the left of Mount Snowdon. And Snowdonia is what it's called. Um, I think Abby Wolf and uh, Dessa were in Cardiff uh, a few weeks back, which is just in the southern part of Wales. Anyways, I, her and I were gushing about the landscape there. There are some trees that are scattered throughout northern Wales called the yew tree. And a lot of these are set on religious properties in order to maintain them. These trees are 1,500 to 2,000 years old. They're the oldest trees in the world. Um, and there's one, you walk on this passageway out towards um, where the ocean flows into Manai Bridge. And you walk um, around the corridor and as soon as you round the curve that leads you over to this small island, you see this giant mother effing tree. I'm, I don't know if it's being recorded this evening, so. <laughs> the, the yew tree, what I learned um, is that it dies on the inside and composts the waste of itself to regenerate life. So that's how it's so old and that's how it continues to live. These moments, um, for all the stories I try to tell and try to sing, those kind of moments, it's uh, where language fails us, where I am just completely grateful and humble of where music has yet again taken me. Um, and I just wanna thank y'all for coming. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here and lock arms with you and engaging in these stories and uh, in the movement on addressing climate change. Thank you so much.
also know who this song is in homage to. Whoa. 
woke up from a crazy dream last night. You were in my arms, sleeping by my side. Pull me from a dark, cold place in my mind. This does the warmest thing to find. Yeah, I would wait for the sun to come up. Thank you. 